Drivers seem to pay little attention as they zoom past workers at the Highway 17 and 707 interchange project. It's to make those drivers wake up and slow down that the family of 22-year-old Kenneth Peanut Long is pushing for a tougher law. Long was a flagman who died in a Williamsburg County crash last year. The driver who hit him paid $300 in fines. The DOT engineer for Horry County says there's not much more officials can do to make work zones safer, but higher fines might help. The fact of the matter is money talks, and so maybe if if doubling the penalty is going to get somebody to put the phone away or, or you know, pay more attention, then I'm for it. The safety director for Palmetto Paving Company says one big problem is driver complacency around major projects. Drivers tend to get very acclimated to construction areas that have been in place for a long period of time. And the goal is really just that whenever a driver sees the orange signs, that they have to slow down. Peanuts law would increase the maximum speeding fine in a work zone to $400. If an injury results, it could be up to $1,000 and 30 days in jail. Half the money raised from the higher fines would pay for more state troopers to patrol work zones. The DOT engineer says that would make a difference. You know, once people know that they're out there and they're watching, they tend to slow down. And so I do think that's a great idea.